to see him <clears throat> struggle so much and go through so much pain is uh, it's very sad and it, it it hurts me, you know, as as um, as uh, you know his longtime friend, colleague, rival. I've nurtured. Uh, very uh, good relationship with him on and off the court. I'm proud, you know, to have that kind of uh, relationship that will go on hopefully for, for many more years, regardless of whether, you know, we get to play against each other or not and, you know, whether he continues playing and whatever happens. Everybody can understand where he comes from, you know, at some point, you know, when you're, you feel like you're never going to get back to 100% um, and you've had the success that Andy's had. Uh, you know, you, you can only understand the decision, you know. Now, uh, I was disappointed and uh, uh, sad and a little bit shocked, you know, to um, that, to know now that we're going to lose him at some point, but we're going to lose any, everybody at some point. So it's just that now it's uh, definite. It hits us top guys uh, hard, you know, because we know Andy very well. We like him. Um, he doesn't have many enemy, enemies, to be quite honest, you know, and uh, he's, a, he's a good guy. and. Uh, Hall of Famer, legend, everything, he won everything he, he wanted to, to win. Everybody would substitute, you know, his career with his and, uh, and he's a great guy. So, yeah, it's a, it's a tough one, but um, one down the road, well, he, he can look back on and be incredibly proud of everything he, he has achieved.